Money Learning Channel Museum. In last video, we have reviewed major, minor chord, and major seventh chord and minor seventh chord plus sustained chord too. And in this video, we're going to review the left hand chord pattern. Do you remember what kind of chord pattern we have learned so far? Yes, block the chord. Basically, if you see the letters, you just play blocking it and play it everything. If it's a G chord, you play G. If it's an A, you play A chord. And the next pattern is 1-5-1 pattern, which is, if it's a C, you play a C and 5 means top note of the chord and 1 means the same one. requested this one for a long time ago but finally I can upload it this one because we learned all these chords so let's see how we can variate the left hand with this chord symbols and left hand patterns if you're looking at the song 
song or just see the right hand with letters, right? C chord, so this will be C major. And what about the next chord? E, M slash B means E minor chord, but B will be on the bottom. So E minor chord will be E, one, two, three, minor chord, right? And one, two, three, four. So it will be like this, but B has to be on the bottom here. Bottom to top, not like you know, 
level. But in here, you just need to see how we figured it out the left hand chord by reading the symbols and how do we edit this chord in different patterns. Now, if you're moving on to the third line, A minor. Yeah, so you can just play an A and if it's an A7.